All right, next up, we've got Bowling Green and Western Michigan. Bowling Green, uh, one and a half point road favorites, 52 and a half being the total here in this game. Uh, as far as the, uh, uh, I guess, motivation levels are, are concerned, uh, Bowling Green at, uh, right now at six and five. Uh, so they are comfortably uh, bowl eligible. Uh, Western Michigan sitting at uh, four and seven on the year. So uh, they aren't going to be bowl eligible, uh, even if they win this game. I guess technically if they get to five wins, if there's some opt-outs for bowl games and teams saying, hey, we're not going to a bowl game, declining an invite, technically they could invite a five-win team. Um, but I don't know if I trust Western Michigan enough. I'll say this about Bowling Green. I, I really have liked what I've seen lately from them offensively. Uh, because I think Connor Bazelak and that offense has been capable. Uh, we have seen them score 24 plus in three straight games, four straight overs for this Bowling Green team. Um, Western Michigan was rolling offensively for a couple of weeks there against Eastern Michigan and Central Michigan. I came back to the well with Western Michigan last week at Northern Illinois in the over, and all of a sudden this rolling offense just completely does nothing. Shut out uh, in that loss. Uh, against Northern Illinois last week. Kind of surprising because I was really liking the uh, trajectory of the offense. Hayden Wolf was playing pretty well at quarterback. So your guess is as good as mine, what we get to see from Western Michigan. But Bowling Green is not a defense that can totally shut you down. So I think there's a chance for uh, Western Michigan to move the ball. I certainly think Bowling Green can have success offensively here in this game. Like I said, that offense is in good form. Uh, and the Western Michigan defense, worth noting that in uh, four of their last uh, five, there's five, six, actually, one, let me count it up here. One, two, three, four, five, five of their last seven games, they've given up at least 24 points. So to me, you know, I'm interested a little bit, maybe in an over or maybe even a Bowling Green team total over, something like that. Uh, I think Bowling Green's deserving to be a road favorite. I do think they are the better of these two teams, but I get a little concerned about laying points on the road with a team that just clinched. Uh, you know, or has been clinched bowl eligibility, yeah. not last week, but they had it clinched a couple of weeks ago. They're coming off a, quite the battle uh, against Toledo last week, 32, 31 tough loss. tough loss. They probably should have won it. They led the majority of that game. So now you got to lay points with them on the road, tough spot, but they are the better of these teams. I don't trust Western Michigan. So I lean bowling green, but if I bet it, I'll probably look more toward a team total for them uh, in this one. What do you think, Connor? Yeah. Last week, that was tough. Kind of leading the whole way. Toledo's defense comes up big. They only scored three in the second half. Got outscored 15 to three, you know, and lose by one. That was it uh, with Bowling Green. So they could have won it. I w was with you. I almost went with Western Michigan last week. Like I was going all the way, talking about it. I just had to stay off. And yeah, I didn't think they would get shut out. Illinois needed a step up game after getting killed there. It seems like four straight weeks. Both these teams have been pretty good against the number. Like you mentioned, one place Western Michigan has been awful is on the road. Another team, Bavano and better at home, three and one. Because I all the way around, Bowling Green, to me, is the better team. They should be able to score, so I get why you're on the team total. I don't know if I want to bet this. I think Western Michigan plays better in this matchup. They were just awful last week. They had no rushing yards, like 24 rushing yards. It was it was rough to watch for Western Michigan. I think you bet. I think this game could be competitive. Don't really love an angle to bet on it. You know, totals right there. I don't know if we get over under. So uh, this is off for me. All right, uh, pass for Connor Mack uh, in this one. 